Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here on what we have, which is h raised to the power x minus 2 equals to 20 from here. This follows from a raised to the power m minus n, which can be written as a raised to the power m over a raised to the power n. Like this here, we have x raised to the power x over 8 squared then equals to 20 from this side. Then also here, this same thing as x raised to the power x over 8 squared here, that's 64, then equals to 20 on this side. Then also here, this is 20 over 1. And when we cross multiply, h raised to power x times 1 is t h raised to power x then equals to here we have 20 times 64 from here. The next step here, we can take the log on both sides. That is, here we have log h raised to power x equals to log 20 times 64 from here. Then applying the power law of logarithm here from log m raised to power p, which is equals to p log m. Then what we have here becomes x log 8, then equals to log 20 times 64 from here. Then from here we divide both sides by log 8. This divide here by log 8, also divide this side by log 8, which implies here log 8 comes to each other, and we are left with x, which is equal to log 20 times 64, then over log 8 here. And also from here, what we have here follows the law of logarithm. When we have log a times b, this can be written as log a plus log b. That is, here we have x equals to log 20 plus log 64, then over log 8 here. The next step, we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to log 20 over log 8, then plus, here we have log 64 over log 8. Then next step here, we can express 64 as 8 times 8, which is 8 squared. And here we have x equals to log 20 over log 8, then plus. Here we have log 64 now become log 8 square over log 8. That is. Here we apply the power of logarithm. We have x now equals to log 20 over log 8, then plus 2 log 8 over log 8 here. That is, log 8 comes to each other here, and we have 2 left, so we have x now equals to log 20 over log 8 plus 2 then also here we can write 20 as that is 20 same thing as 4 times 5 then what we have here becomes x equals to log 4 times 5 then over log 8 here yeah, plus 2 and also here yeah, this follows the law of logarithm and what we have becomes x equals to log 4 plus log 5 then over log 
8 plus 2 here. That is, this, we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to log 4 over log 8 then plus log 5 over log 8 plus 2 here. That is from here. We can express 4 as 2 times 2, which is 2 squared, and also 8 as 2 times 2 times 2, which is 2 to the power 3. Then what we have becomes x equals to log 2 squared over log 2 raised to the power 3, then plus here we have log 5 over log 2 raised to the power 3 plus 2 from here. Then applying the power of logarithm here, 2 comes here and also from here, and we have x now equals to 2 log 2 over here, we have 3 log 2, then plus log 5 over 3 log 2 here, plus 2 from here. Then log 2 here cancel each other and we have x now equals to 2 over 3 then plus here also we have 1 over 3 then log 5 over log 2 then plus 2 here and when we apply change of this here from log a over log b which can be written as log a to base b then what we have becomes x equals to 2 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 5 base 2 then plus 2 from here so here we have the value of x here as 2 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 5 base 2 plus 2 now let's check if this satisfies this given problem that is here we substitute the value of x which is x equals to 2 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 5 is 2 plus 2 then what we have becomes 8 raised to power x which is now 2 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 5 is 2 plus 2 and also we have minus 2 here is equals to 20 on this side and from here plus 2 minus 2 cancel out then we are left with 8 raised to power 2 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 5 is 2 is it equals to 20 on this side then here we can express 8 as 2 raised to power 3 then raised to power here we can bring this power together SM is 3 so we have 2 plus log 5 base 2 here then is equals to 20 from here then this power multiplies from the law of indices and 3 cancel each other we have 2 raised to power 2 plus log 5 is 2 left is equals to 20 on this side and of course when we separate this this becomes 2 raised to power 2 times 2 raised to power log 5 is 2 is equals to 20 from here and 2 raised to power 2 here that's 4 then times here follows from a raised to power log b base a which is equals to b from here that is here we have 5 is equals to 20 on this side of course 4 times 5 here is 20 which is equals to 20 from here left hand side equals to the right hand side hence from here we conclude that x equals to 2 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 5 is 2 plus 2 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe to master t math class turn the description bell and share this video give it a thumbs up put your comment see you next class and bye for now